Okay, people come from all over the world because they come to visit New Mexico and they want to see what's local. They don't come to see German food or Italian food. They come to see New Mexican food. And since we specialize in New Mexico baking cuisine, they come here. This is the, this is the biscochito dough. Then from there, I'm going to use my cookie cutter, which is that cookie cutter right there. And then I'm going to use my rolling pin because I'm going to roll it down, extend the dough basically down to a certain thickness so that I can cut. And then I'm going to start cutting. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut and turn so it pops in my hand. And I'm going to put them here. I'm going to put them, I'm going to put eight in one row and the cross is going to be five. I'm going to get 40 cookies in each one. They're going to rise a little bit. It's got baking powder in the recipe. Basically, this is it, my friend, and it's just a repetition of what we do. So it's very simple, but it's also a repetition. It gets a little dull sometimes to be doing this. That's why grandma gets tired. Now I won't compete with her, but she's too good. That's what your grandma's been doing for centuries here in New Mexico. It's always better to get grandma's. Okay, so I'm here, I'm gonna go here and then I'm gonna take it and follow me to the oven. So I'm gonna put it in here and it's gonna stay for about 15 minutes and then I'll bring it out and then I'm gonna powder it with sugar. When I do this, I'm going to be making 60 dozen at a time. And so you can see 60 dozen a week was pretty good. We've done it for 50 years now, so we're pretty efficient and well organized. So we got a reputation for doing a pretty good job on it. And we get people from all over that want to celebrate New Mexico and these are our state cookies, so what more than that?